Morning, new information tonight about what could happen to the UConn football program after the university announced it was leaving the American Athletic Conference to join the Big East. And today at the AAC Football Media Day, Channel 3 Sports Director Joe Zone tried to get some answers. No, they, they won't be able to play football in the conference if they're not a mem full member. American Athletic Commissioner Mike Oresco telling me today at the conference media days that UConn is not welcome without the rest of the school sports teams, which are headed to the Big East as soon as next year. Oresco and UConn Athletic Director Dave Benedict are currently working on an exit plan. We've had several uh, in-person meetings, we've had several phone conversations. Uh, we appreciate uh, the, the, the process. They were in the room today, but that's about as much acknowledgement as the conference allowed UConn. They were not permitted to attend important league events. For instance, Randy Etzel did not attend the coaches meeting. We have a schedule for 2019. That's all we're concerned about. Any of the other stuff, that's, that's, that's other people's you know, work to, be, to, to take care of. There's a perception among UConn football fans that you've bailed on football in favor of basketball. How would you respond to that? Yeah, I, listen, I certainly um, understand how some people might perceive it that way. I would, I would argue that, look, I think we've done uh, the right thing for a lot of our programs, and we have to figure out a different path, potentially, for football. While negotiations continue on how many millions of dollars it'll cost UConn to leave the conference, it could be as much as 10 million. The Huskies will play one last season in the American. In Newport, at the American Athletic Conference Football Media Days, Joe's own Channel 3 Eyewitness News.